like using learning slides and because I know what's going to be going on throughout the week then I know that like if I was to say like on tomorrow or something I would have like a PE or something I'd know that like at the start of the week. So every week um, we don't necessarily recreate our learning slides we kind of have a template that we then swap out every week um, so we are editing and slightly changing it. So basically our learning intentions and our description of the activity changes every week, but the template and overall look of the slideshow stays the same. I like the way learning slides are set up because they're really easy to access and then you can just like scroll down, decide what you want to do and then just get on with your work and it's really good. When I was in year five, I first started and moved up from year four, it was different and our teacher casted it onto the screen and showed us how we would learn this way. So learning how to create the learning slides was a little bit of an adjustment for me, but it's essentially just putting activities that you would do in the classroom onto slides so the kids can do them independently on their devices. So once you wrap your head around that, you don't have to you know, go crazy and create new things, um, then it just really fits into what we're doing in the classroom. It was definitely an adjustment. I felt like I had to reinvent the wheel every time, but once I did realize that, you know, I can put reading comprehension on the slides with a set of questions, or I can put some maths questions up and they can, you know, drag things around to put, sort shapes and stuff, then it actually became one of my favorite parts of planning because I was creating these rich activities that I was thinking oh gosh how am I going to find time in the classroom for them well they can go and do them independently and I'm making sure all my bases are covered and they've got differentiated learning to do independently which has been really really big for them. So when we go to plan for the next week we all come together and um, we organise what we plan based on our school's inquiry and it changes every term. Um, and then we choose a novel, a class novel, that fits into our inquiry. So we like to integrate all our subjects and learning together. And then we each plan a different subject area. So I might do writing, the other teacher will do reading, the other teacher will do maths. And we go off and plan independently based on what we had discussed at our meeting. Um, and then we share that amongst each other and we take uh, that teacher's planning and adapt it to suit our class. So it's not always exactly what that teacher planned. We alter it to suit our children's needs and um, interests.